Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Andrea and this is Beauty with Andy. If you've not been here before, a massive warm welcome to you. So today we are going to be pulling out some new palettes for the next two weeks. So I used to do it where Pretty Random chose my palettes for the week, but it was just getting too much. So I've decided to do it bi-weekly or fortnightly, if you will. Um, and I feel like I'll be able to get all seven looks done in two weeks and then we'll be able to do then I'll be able to do some other videos as well, some newer content because I don't know, I mean sometimes I get a bit fed up of just watching looks on a channel like I'll get fed up of watching um, people do eyeshadow looks constantly and I like so I like new content so I've decided to do that and I've got a collaboration that I'm in on the 20th of each month I'll link it here the previous one that we did if you've not already seen it <coughs> I'm losing my voice sorry about this I've also got my shop my stash every week so the shop my stash portion of it will continue every week it's just the eyeshadow palettes that are going to continue every fortnight and the reason I'm doing it is because it's just overwhelming. I just can't get through seven palettes in seven days. I was doing it for like five weeks and, you know, I felt so much pressure to get all these looks up. And then when I wanted another video going up, I was putting two videos up in one day. Not everyone wants to see that from me. Um, so I decided just to do it seven days over the two week period. But you will see it go up as like one week. Um, so you'll see seven days, seven looks, seven. And in reality, I'll just be pulling these palettes every two weeks. You'll notice that in my shop, my stash, anyway. Um, so yeah, we're just going to get into it. I'm going to show you what I pulled last week. So we're going to do it like we, we do the shop, my stash. So I'm going to show you what I pulled last week. And then... There are some things in from the previous week, so we're going to keep those in. Um, anyway, let's just get into it. Okay, so this palette here, I used, I used it continuously for pretty much three or four times of the week. So it's a really, really beautiful palette. I especially, I especially love this shade here. This blue is really nice. Um, that's a really, really nice. They're all really, really nice shades, but these duo chromes are the nicest ones in the palette. It's a Stila Blue Realm Velvet Eyeshadow Palette. Mine's gone a bit squeaky for some bizarre reason. Um, then I also did a look with this. So it's the Elf Meant to Be Quad. Yeah. Um, and I used all four shades, which I was surprised at because normally I wouldn't use all four shades, but I wanted to test it out. So there is a look going to be going on the channel with that soon. Um, then I used this one. So this is the Natasha Denona. So it's the Natasha Denona Chromium in Scarab. So that one can go back. Um, this one's going back as well. I haven't used it. Um, but we're going to be using some of the other Stila ones that I haven't used, so that can go back. And then this one was in Testing Tuesday last week. It's the XX Revolution in the shade Direct, so that one can go back as well. So let's just put that drawer back, and I'll talk to you about the other things. That was the second drawer. Ugh. Gosh, I hate speaking us. Right, okay, so these palettes I didn't use, and primarily I didn't use them, was because I did a Shop My Stash, a birthday week Shop My Stash, and these stayed in. So this is the Makeup Obsession Be In Love With, so it looks like that, it's very neutral. I did use it for a Valentine's Day look, but I didn't use it as part of the one of seven eyeshadow looks, so it has to stay in, so I can use it for that. And then... We've got this Revolution Neutrals versus Neutrals. It's getting on the older side now, so I am glad Pretty Random asked me to use it, but I've still not used it yet, and I did want to test these out, so it needs to stay in for another week without a shadow of a doubt. So we've already got two palettes in, so we can only really choose five. So I'm going to get Pretty Random. I'm going to choose Pretty Random. Let me just pop this drawer back. 
So pretty random has already chosen five and I can choose two. So I'm gonna let pretty random choose three and I'll choose two. So I've got the book here. Oh, like all this here is going back. Let's put the glitters back before I lose them. Yeah, let's put them back. And I'll show you what I'm keeping out that I never got to use. So I didn't get to use this Pixie by Petra in Pixie Green. So that's staying in. This Steeler in Eternal I didn't get to use. That's staying in. And this Steeler in Infinite, that's staying in. And if I do get the chance, I don't think I will. Um, I'm going to be using this W7 hashtag Oto hashtag ott magic metals in the shade out of the blue um the rest are just eyeshadow palettes which i'm gonna put back so the eyeshadow palettes that pretty random chose for me i'm gonna pick ones that i haven't used for a long time so we've got i'll tell you what we've got so we've got the Too Faced semi Sway, the urban decay Kristen leanne the Technique Pro Finish, the Colourpop Going Coconuts and the Jeffree Star Beauty Killer. Right, so I know for a fact, we need to do a process of elimination now, so I know for a fact I've used Colourpop Going Coconuts and I did really want to use it. It could be my one of two that I pulled. Um, so we'll, we'll say no to that for now um, and we'll just go over to the eyeshadow palette drawer and have a look like just have a look at the palettes and that way I can do that process of elimination so let's head over there right so the Urban Decay should be in this drawer here yeah it is that's it there it's really really beautiful and I haven't used it for a long time right well you will definitely use that so that's one that's being used um we're gonna use the Jeffree Star as well I think the colour stories are pretty similar um, but I do want to use it. I've not used it in a long time. Um, so we'll use that. So that's two. So we can only choose one more. I don't want to use the Too Faced Semi Sweet. Okay, so we'll we'll just choose this one. This Technique Pro Finish. And then I can choose two. Right, so we need to go to my acrylic unit for that. Okay, so we're going to be going in this acrylic unit here um, and I'm going to be pulling something I didn't pull last week. So, it's the Natasha Denona Mini Retro Palette. I got this for my birthday off my sister and I just didn't use it. I feel like, I don't know, I feel like I want to do two different looks with that. So we've already, I might just pull this one and then obviously once I've done all seven looks, we can always pull something else. Um, this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull this as well, this um, Natasha Denona, so like when I've finished the 7 days 7 look 7 palettes I can dip into this um, because there's so many shades I've not even used, it's absolutely pretty but I've not used it and I got this um, for Black Friday obviously in November, I, I think I kind of kept it Christmas for myself and I've just not used it so yeah let's go ahead and use that okay so we've got quite a variety here we've got the Natasha Denona um, it's just absolutely beautiful so we'll be using that we've got the Technique Pro finish which is nice as well but I've had it for so long and it's taking a lot of room up in the collection it's pretty thin but it's quite wide um, so I don't know if I want to keep that one then we've got the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Beauty Killer don't come for me guys it is in my collection and obviously I want to use it up so this one is really really pretty as well not sure what I'm going to come up with there um, when I use that one because it's quite bright this one is very similar to the Jeffree Star Cosmetics just with the fact that it's got bright shades in it but I absolutely adore this palette I love this shade here because it's blue there and then white there and when you mix them together you get a really nice duochrome and I'm all about the duochromes at the moment don't know if you're going to be able to see it but I'm going to swatch it So. 
so it's just there ignore this swatch here but it's really really pretty and then obviously we've got the other two that are in the collection i don't know if i'm going to get around to those liquids to be honest but i'm going to try um obviously we've got two weeks to play with this stuff and not one so i should be able to and do a looks with them so we're going to have looks with the seven days seven palettes and then we're going to have some more like testing videos if you will and there will be they will be labeled testing videos so you know what they are but yeah guys let's go and put these away and then that will conclude the video okay so the palettes go in these bottom two drawers here so let's do that now so they're not going in any particular order i'm just grabbing for them um natasha That's not going to fit, that's going to be too bulky. Okay, and then this is in the bottom drawer. We'll remove that. I don't think this is going to fit though. I like the might. Yeah, it's just going to fit. Right, so I'll show you what it looks like. So this is where I keep everything. Um, so we've got the Beauty Killer, the Natasha Denona Glam, the Kristen Leanne, and then the Mini Retro there. I'm going to put that here. So I, I want that to be one of the first palettes I do a look with this, um, this week. And then we've got the Technique Pro Finish, the Makeup Obsession, and the Revolution. In fact, I should use these two first considering they need them looks need to go up before them looks do um but yeah this is what this little part of the desk looks like so guys so guys that's everything for today thank you so much for watching it really does mean a lot to me if you're not already subscribed please hit that subscribe button down below please click the notifications bell please like because it really does help out the channel share and comment and i will see you in my next one bye guys